Way back in 2014, I made a short video on how to waterproof the hood or roof on your convertible car very, very cheaply using something called FabSeal. That video went on to be quite a hit for my channel and I still get comments about it even now, six years later. So I thought I'd do a second video to not only update the information, but perhaps also answer some of the questions that I keep getting asked. The product I use is called FabSeal. Now this is a waterproofing agent that's mostly used in camping to waterproof tents and also raincoats. A fair few people said that outside the UK they couldn't find this product, but if you go to any camping outlet or a camping website, there should be something there that you could buy that will waterproof tents, and that should work just as well, although I can't guarantee it. Like most things, the more you buy in quantity, the cheaper it becomes, and that's why I buy the two and a half litre, or in fact, I have now bought the five litre can, and I found that the smaller two and a half litre can gave me four applications. For my car, because it's stored off-road during the winter, I just do one application a year, but if you're gonna use your car throughout the winter, I would consider doing this twice and doing two separate coats on the roof each time. Another thing that I have found over time, although this product is clear, it doesn't stain the roof in any way, my roof has become darker every time that I use it and some brown stains that were on the roof before have completely now disappeared. So it certainly does improve the appearance of the roof. One of the main questions I've had asked on that video is people have said, you know, my roof is slightly porous, it's slightly leaking. Will this product make it 100% waterproof again? And to be honest, the truthful answer is no. Unless you have a vinyl hood or roof, in which case this product won't work at all, just don't go there. A canvas roof is designed to let the top layer soak in water and beneath that you have a hopefully completely 100% watertight membrane which stops the water getting into the car. As you can see in this clip, which is a thunderstorm that I took a couple of weeks ago, once you've coated your roof in FabSeal, it certainly will help to bead water. It will help repel the water away from the fabric. But after about 10 minutes of torrential rain, it will soak into the fabric. So what's the product doing? Well, what it's doing is it's stopping the fabric retaining the water. What happens in a canvas hood or roof is that over time that the fabric becomes quite porous, the fabric retains the water and that's when you can get that horrible green and brown mold that starts to grow in your roof and you can get products that can remove that but it's a real ball ache once that starts if unfortunately your roof has got to that stage well after you've treated the mold it's probably best to buy a dyeing kit to return it to its dark color before then you think about putting on some fab cell so i just thought i'd make this video to answer give you an update and to answer a few questions i'll leave a link to the original video i'll leave that at the pop-up at the end and i'll leave it in the description because it's still relevant in 2020 this product still works and continues to work but uh, that's it it for this video i hope you've enjoyed it i hope it's been helpful if so please give me the thumbs up and maybe consider a sub but uh, as for now as always cheers stay safe enjoy your car and i'll catch you all on the next one Bye.